Hi guys, Debbie here. I'm coming at you with a little DIY. I'm going to be doing another cardboard house. So uh, this one is very simple. As you guys could see, I'm in my pajamas. I'm in my onesie, you know. Let me tell ya, it is cold. When I tell you cold, it's cold. So we are expecting by Sunday, starting a Sunday evening. By Monday, eight to 12 inches of snow. So it's cold. It's like 20, 29, 30 degrees right now. I don't like winter, it's cold. So anyway, guys, I'm gonna be doing a little house. You guys recognize this, right? You guys recognize this. Um, recognize this. This is the flaps of the box. You know when you open the box, the flaps and the sides that you close the thing. So this is the two on the shorter side. This is the one on the long side. So I only need one of the long one because I'm gonna cut it. So this is the one on the side, which I measure about an inch. See, I put it together like this, you guys, see? Well, of course, it's not number on this one, but you guys get the idea. So I cut about an inch, so I made it thinner. I left the bottom because I wanna make sure, I wanna um, do it in a way that I'm gonna put one on top of the other. I'm going to um, hand glue it, but first I'm gonna make a hole here because I'm gonna be using one of those, um, do you know the village lights, la, um, the vi the villages, they come in ceramic, the lights, they come on the side with the little clip, so I got plenty of those, so. So as you will see, this is gonna be like the back. This is gonna be the front of the house. I'm still gonna be doing some white ones. Um, and then I'm going to uh, either do the windows with the white or I'm just going to do it like this, an idea. Well, let me do it like this, an idea. You guys will, oh, I don't know how I'm gonna do this. Oh, this light's not working. Let me grab the other light. So the light from the inside, when I turn it on, you guys are going to be able to see like the light. See the light coming through, like the box? because the foam is thin foam. So, I'm gonna glue some of the foam and this is, see how the guys, so just with the flashlight, so with the lights, you guys gonna see it better. Instead of me putting windows on it. So I'm gonna do it like that. So, yep. But yep, I'm doing another house, so I'm gonna leave it right there. And I'm coming at you with the progress. All right, guys? So I'll be right. I'm back, guys, with a little bit of my progress. So I cut my two walls. So this one has the side of Davis. And then this one is just going to have the um, pyramid looking up, which is going to be... I have or the Star of Davis. For a lot of people, it might not symbolize nothing, but to me, it symbolizes a lot. So, you guys gonna see that at the end? Believe it or not, this little piece here is gonna be the roof because it's gonna be an even roof to the size of the wall. And then here on this space, there's gonna be the triangle part. I'm going to be making it that one all from just this. And then in the back, in the inside, I will be have something in cardboard on the inside of the white roof, which is gonna be the part that's gonna show up front. So you're gonna see the shadow coming from inside of the house with the white out and the shadow is gonna be the cardboard inside, the design that I'm going to put inside. 
so that's just a little bit more progress so now i'm gonna start putting it together with the glue and i'm gonna come at you and i'm gonna show you what i'm going to do and unfortunately i have to pause again because i did not heat up my glue gun so i'll be right back guys with a little bit of more progress okay be right back and how you guys doing today how was your thanksgiving we have my sister my niece her kids i mean my son, my daughter, my daughter took food home. I mean, there was a lot of food. Everybody ate in. The leftovers, we had them yesterday, which was better than the first day. I always said the leftovers are always better, depending how you season, how you season your food. But I hope everybody had a great Thanksgiving, and I will come back at you with the house almost completely put together. Okay? I'll be right back. Okay, another little progress. So <clears throat> I glue the house together. This is just the four regular walls. Just have in mind the <clears throat> okay. Um when the walls go white, this is going to be like you guys gonna be able to see like a little crack like this in between the whole thing, so I just gonna but you guys gonna see this part so now I'm gonna go in for the roof and the other I'm gonna put it I'm gonna show you how to turn it white see you just cut you cut out the cardboard like this and then you cut out just the length of the wall in white and you just cover all in white and your house is going to be all white but you're going to see the the design from inside because of the cardboard so i'm gonna go and show you the last step you either cover it with foam or white paper but i decided to cover it with foam and let me tell you yeah, it was a mistake because these little things see how See that? Stick to everything. You see what I'm wearing? Right? Yeah. I was all covered with it. I was like, I was trying to run away from it. And it was following me. Oh, my word. So, guys, I'm going to come at you with the end of it. And I'm going to use my little lantern flashlight to show you what she looks like with the main light off. And hopefully you guys like it. And... This video is for anybody that is 18 to 21 and over. Because since I'm showing a little house, I don't want it to be child attractive. But this is a DIY for Christmas decoration, not for children. So 18 to 21 years old and older because i don't know and depend where you live in you are considered an adult or not so with adult supervisions i'm not showing what i'm using because i'm using things that could cut somebody so i don't want to show nothing here but with adult supervision by all means so let's finish and show you the last product i'll be right back well guys i'm back i'm finished and i hope you like it i mean i think i did a good job i still have to finish the top of the roof on the top but the rest i'm not gonna do nothing else to it because i think it looks awesome so let's this is what it looks like so i'm about to turn on the light and Hopefully, you guys could see that's the light inside. That little um, light that you guys see there. Um, you see the guy, guys? You see guys see the light inside? So, and this is the top part. So, um, let me get you guys out of here. Here, 
this is um, the side of it. Um, you guys see the light coming through. Hopefully you guys could see that, the triangle on the side. So, yeah. But, um, and that's the front of it. Um, that's the side. But it doesn't look strong enough inside because the light right now, oh, hold on guys. But anyways, let me turn the light, show it to you guys. This is, this is the roof. This is what she looks like. Uh, it's red on the side, it's white. She has little hearts, um, like candy drop. And she's still gonna be finished. I still gotta put the little white part here. And then, of course, the line size is not strong enough, so whoop, it fell, oh, fell over. So, guys, I hope you like it. Share, subscribe, and this is a DIY. When I finish it completely, completely, I'm gonna show it with the. Um, remember, guys, that I did a DIY with the um, snow woman, so I did a teenager. Um, I did a teenager and a baby, so you guys are gonna like it. So I have the whole snowman family. Um, this is gonna be put on the mat on the bookshelf with the other one on the side, and then I had the half a gallon to do the skinny one. So that one is just gonna be plain skinny one. And I hope you guys like it. And yeah, I was bored, so thank you and to all my subscribers, welcome. Um, and remember guys, don't do what you would like to have done, be kind to one another, don't forget to smile. And this is David saying to the next one, and remember this video is for 18 to 21 years and older. Bye-bye.